Kate Barton never leaves home without her cloth face mask. Why is it important for you to wear a mask? Um, just to be a good neighbor, you know, just kind of look out for people and also to protect like my family and my kids. Cloth face coverings are recommended to help prevent people who may have the coronavirus from spreading it to others. Now new research looks at how many layers homemade masks may need to prevent viral droplets from the nose and mouth from being dispersed. They showed that two layers um, is much better than one layer and one layer is much better than than nothing. Researchers in Australia used a light system and high speed camera for the study. In these visualizations, you can see the airborne droplets produced by healthy people speaking, coughing, and sneezing while wearing no mask, a one layer covering, two layer covering, and a three ply surgical mask. Professor Kimberly Prather researches aerosols at UC San Diego and says we have to be cautious with these kinds of studies because they may not capture the smallest particles. Realize that the teeniest ones, the ones where the infectious virus could be concentrated, so they aren't seeing those. The layers of a face covering may be important, but so is fit. The mask should cover your nose and mouth and fit snugly against the sides of your face. If you don't have it fitting to your face, things will just leak out and then it start, they start to not be as effective. Experts also emphasize that masks are just one barrier and that we still need to wash hands, keep social distance and avoid crowded indoor spaces to limit the spread of the virus. Naomi Rockham, CBS News, New York.